I have a choice. And the choice is purely up to me. I can choose to be status quo and be a checkboxer, or I can elevate my game and focus on becoming a true quality professional. Hey, it's Joe. I'm here with John Spear from Greenlight Guru. Hey, John. John, you talked about a checkbox mentality. What exactly does that mean? And what's the alternative? A checkbox mentality is somebody who, who's just going through the motions. They're just trying to check a box and make sure that they've satisfied what the regulatory bodies, the ISO auditing groups, the FDA, what they think that they want. So they're, they're not really interested in what the content is or what the process is. They just want to check the box. A true quality professional. It's someone that rises above just checking a box on the form and understands why these changes are important, especially for the patients who are going to receive our medical products. Thank you, John. What does the EU MDR look like for a checkboxer? versus a true quality professional. I want to start with the true quality professional. Let's give people the best possible outcome of shifting their mindset. And the true quality professional gets ahead of the situation. They don't wait for it to happen to them. And with the changes in EU MDR, I mean, the the checkboxer is going to wait. The true quality professional is being proactive. They're reaching out to the notified bodies. They're they're intimately involved in trying to understand what is changing about the regulations in Europe and how that impacts their products. And they're trying to make sure that, that they understand not only what the regulatory bodies need, but also what is important to the patient. Now the checkboxer, maybe not so much. They're not putting any value in it. And, and the thing about that is when you, when you take that approach, uh, a year from now, you're gonna have to update your, your technical files, the documentation that's important for the EU CE mark process, which is a big part of this MDR changes. If you just checked a box and you got no value out of that, you're going to go through that step again. You're just going to check a box again and again and again, and you're going to get burnt out as a medical device professional and your products aren't going to improve. Great answer. Thank you. How can Greenlight Guru help the true quality professional? I care very much about uh, about patients. I, I believe wholeheartedly that the reason I'm here on this earth is to help improve the quality of life. And that could be through a number of ways. And what we've done at Greenlight is we're helping the medical device professional, the true quality professional, because we built a platform, software platform, an EQMS software platform that addresses compliance because don't mishear me, you still have to deal with the compliance. But We've taken that guesswork out of the equation for the true quality professional. Now the content, the information that they capture, that they document in Greenlight's Go and Grow products is a single source of truth that allows them to make better informed decisions about ways to improve their products, their processes, their technology, so that in the end, the patient's life will be impacted for the better. You are consistently one of our highest rated speakers. I will see you at MDTX and uh, give me a high five. What do you say? Let's see if we can do this. Uh, (laughs) All right, here we go. No, that's the other hand. No, the other side. This one? Yep, one, two. There you go. It it didn't look right on my end, but if you say so. I don't know if it's gonna make the final cut, but thank you very much. John Spear, everyone. This broadcast was brought to you by MDTX, the Medical Device Technology Exchange. Meet me and John Spear at MDTX, April 3rd through the 5th, in Secaucus, New Jersey at the Meadowlands, where John will present how to implement a risk-based QMS to comply with 13485, leveraging ISO 14971. A two-hour workshop, April 3rd, at the Meadowlands. See you there.